And we are live. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the um, Gold Rush Hall of Fame Autograph Baseball and Hip Parade Autograph Baseball Box Break. Alright, just give me a second. Gotta change the title of the video. And we'll get this show on the road. It's a beautiful day. And an even better day to do some box breaks. So right after the Hall of Fame break, I'll be doing the Hit Parade Baseball. And I believe it is number, break number one, or three, 300, what was it, yesterday, the last one was 58, so 359, and 360, so we just got our 360th break, wow, that's awesome guys, perfect. I got the title changed. Let's start this up. We'll just get back to the spreadsheet and all right, is everything good? All right, everything's great right now. We got this. With 26 spots, we have 508 K Ho. With one spot, we have uh, Covey, or co -IV. Uh Two spots, we have Snake, Snakester. And with one spot, we have Pack Attack. Let's copy and paste our list on randomize.org. As always, we'll be randomizing our list five times. One, two, three, four, and hold on. Is it frozen? No, wait. Oh, I guess I didn't. All right, that's five times. On the top, we have uh, 508. And at the bottom, we have 508. Let's uh, copy our new list. Yo, let's see what teams you guys got. 508 with the Diamondbacks, Braves, Orioles, Red Sox, Cubs, White Sox, Reds, uh, Snakester with the Indians, Covey with the Rockies, or Co Ivy. Um, 508 with the Tigers, Astros, Royals, Angels, Dodgers, Marlins, Brewers, Twins, Mets. Yankees, Athletics, Phillies, Pack Attack with the Pirates, 508 with the Padres, Giants, Mariners, Snakester with the uh, Cardinals, and uh, uh, 508 with the Rays, Rangers, Blue Jays, and Nats. All right, let's uh, open up this box. All right, give me a second. I just... For some reason, it's... All right, perfect. 
All right, let me tune into the live stream, make sure the picture is good. And uh, this, this box is definitely the most high-end or top baseball product um, in the mystery boxes out of all brands. For sure, this is probably, it's crazy high quality and for a great price. I've been truly impressed with the past hits, and I know I keep on mentioning this every time we do this break, but it, it's worth mentioning when we pulled the Joe DiMaggio autographed baseball from this very uh, box, which was awesome. And uh, let's see if we could top this today. That was amazing. The guy who won it was just ecstatic. He was, oh man, as everybody would be. Here, wait. I'm just sealed on all sides. Let's uh, remove the plastic wrapping. And the ceiling. All right, let's see. Looks like a fairly new baseball. Who the Rock? I know who that is. We've pulled uh, his jersey before. Ha ha! One of the definitely one of the most popular fan favorites in the Hall of Fame. Inducted. Oh man, was it two years ago? I believe. Yeah. Oh wait, it says 2017. Never mind. I was just because for some reason it feels it feels it was very current. Which it was, but I thought it was 2018. Uh, yeah, this is awesome. He just has a, a amazing signature. I think it beats the uh, John Smoltz ball that we pulled last time. All of me, 2017, and... It is Tim Raines, obviously, and uh, the JSA authentication. One of the greats. And he's on the all-time stolen base list. He played a crazy long career, but as always, it'll be going to the team that he played for for the longest. Let's look it up. So far, there hasn't been a Hall of Famer that's I that's mediocre. Like, who's a who's a mediocre Hall of Famer that just got in without anybody getting angry at me saying he's not or he's a good player? I can't really think of any. But uh, they have a really great checklist: Mickey Mantle, Joe DiMaggio, everybody, um, Tim Raines. The jersey that we pulled of him was a Expos jersey. His long list of accomplishments, Hall of Fame, seven-time All-Star, two-time World Series champion, Silver Slugger batting title, and All-Star MVP. And he played for numerous teams throughout his career. He's a super nice guy, too. I met him. He was, I don't know what they call him, but he was traveling with the Blue Jays. Kind of like a consultant, but he goes throughout the farm system, or he did at least, a while ago. And they were playing um, a local minor league team that I go to. And I was small. I didn't really know who he was. So 
I still got his autograph and his picture because my dad's like, whoa, it's Tim the Rock Reigns. And I was like, oh, I don't know who that is. But yeah, I'm really happy I got his autograph and he was a really nice guy. Yep, Montreal Expos, 13 years. That is going out to the Expos, which is currently the Nationals. And even though I'm 100% sure, just if you guys have any doubts, let's just see. Current are... Who is or what team team is the expose now? The Washington Nationals. All right, that's going out to whoever has the Nationals. And that is 508 K Ho. Congratulations, man. That's a sweep hole. All right, I posted another one of these if you guys want to check that out. I also have probably the second best um, quality break for uh, any baseball is the TriStar Platinum Baseball Box Break. And we have six spots left in that. So, highly recommend that break. Because that one has also not disappointed me yet. Alright, now we'll uh, move on to the Hit Parade Autograph Baseball Box Break. Just let me pull up a new spreadsheet. All right, perfect. Let's start this one up. With five spots, we have Thomas. With four spots, we have Rick. With one spot, we have Vin Dis. With one spot, we have Rosselli. With one spot, we have Jeff. With one spot, we have BSBR. With two spots, we have Ken. With four spots, we have Quick Flip. With one spot, we have Eeyore Mule. And with 10 spots, we have Aguilar Edgar. Let's uh, copy and paste the list on randomize.org. Oh. Try that again. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. This is the 360th break, and I still can't do that correctly. All right, let's uh, randomize our list five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Alrighty, on the top we have uh, Aguilar, and at the bottom we have Rick. Let's copy our new list. All right, here's the new list of teams. Aguilar with the Diamondbacks, Thomas with the Braves and Orioles, BSBR with the Red Sox, Rick with the Cubs, Eeyore with the White Sox, Aguilar with the Reds, Rick with the Indians, Thomas with the Rockies, Ed, or Ag, Aguilar, sorry, uh, with the Tigers, Quick Flip with the Astros, Aguilar with the Royals, Quick Flip with the uh, Angels, uh, Thomas with the Dodgers, Aguilar with the uh, Marlins, Brewers, Twins, Mets, Rick with the Yankees, Aguilar with the Athletics, Ken with the Phillies, Jeff with the Pirates, Rosselli with the Padres, Quick Flip with the Giants, Ken with the Mariners, Quick Flip with the Cardinals, uh, Vindis with the Rays, 
Aguilar with the Rangers, Thomas with the Jays, and uh, Rick with the Nationals. All right, let's open up this box. Super excited to open up this box just because uh, the top hit um, for this series is Mike Trout, and that's my hero. So <laughs> if we end up pulling a Mike Trout ball and uh, whoever wins it, I'll give them a lot of money for it. I'll overpay for sure. Yeah, they, I'm impressed with this um, this series and the current series. Um, their lineup is really good. When they first started doing these boxes, I didn't uh, get into them because the top hit was only like Cal Ripken Jr. And I mean, he's a great player, but you know, it's uh, I don't think it's worth buying <laughs> a whole case of those. If that's the top hit. All right, let's open up the plastic seal. All right. Let's see what we got. I mean, the top pull so far that we've gotten was a Frank Thomas autographed baseball inscribed uh, three-time MVP, I think. JSA authentication. Here we are. Let's see. That's a familiar autograph. I don't really know. I'm trying to think who that is. That's familiar. Hey, how are you? Any guesses, guys? I'm a bit closer. Here, let's see. It's on the lid of the box. Let's move that to the side really quick. Oh, yeah, we've pulled this guy two times already. Ryan Mountcastle. He is, um... One of the top prospects for the Orioles. And, yep. Yeah, uh, I'd say AAA, I believe, because he was in AA last season with uh, the Bowie Bay Sox. I think he's um, in AAA now. But yeah, prospects are always interesting to get because you never know. All it takes is one week of really good hitting, and everybody wants it autographed by them. Um, so you never know what could happen. All those 10th round draftees, like Kevin Pillar making a statement for themselves and becoming stars, even though, uh, they weren't even, uh, big names drafted in the 10th round and stuff like that. I think he's, um, Ryan Mountcastle was drafted in... Second round? That's just a guess. But, um, all right. Let's, uh, see what team he played for for the longest, which is obviously the Orioles, but, uh, just to check. Um, I know the first time we pulled him was, uh, it was a full-sized batting helmet with the old-time Orioles logo, which was really nice. Second time we pulled him was a jersey and... This is our third time, so now it's a baseball. So <laughs> we have a lot of Ryan Mountcastle autographs that have been pulled. I know he was in spring training, too. Let's 
see. Yep, Norfolk, Norfolk Tides. Triple A for the um, Orioles. So obviously that's going out to the Orioles. Actually, hold on. Let's just, I want to see his stats really quick. See how he's doing so far. Is there any stats? Oh, it's loading. And uh, so far this season, his batting average, oh, 286. That's pretty good. On base percentage is 325. He has four homers already in 19 games, 20 hits, three doubles, one triple, 17 RBIs. Not too bad. Good start to the season. Um, all right. That's going out to the Baltimore Orioles. Let's see who's got them. Oh, wait. That's not. There it is. Oh, wow. You're on a two-break win streak. You won last night. Uh, Thomas Spear. Thomas Spear, congratulations, man. Uh, you win the Ryan Mountcastle Autograph Baseball. I posted another if you guys want to check that out. And like I just said um, recently, I have only six spots left for the TriStar Platinum Baseball Box Break. I'm ready to break that as soon as possible. And... Um, what else do we have? Everything's been selling out so quick, which is honestly amazing. I want to thank you all so much. And I'm really enjoying the breaks now, especially we're doing so many baseball breaks. And we've been pulling pretty good players the past uh, 20 breaks. And hopefully we'll keep that streak alive going forward. Thank you guys again so much. And um, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.